Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Wednesday the 29th of August where I take just one of our signals from our stock scanner membership area and set it up using our Elliott Wave indicator suite. So in our members area, we get the opportunity to download long fifth wave trades, potential short fifth wave trades on the 60 minute the daily and the weekly time frames also stochastic long signals and stochastic short signals on intraday interested in the long signals today did a short yesterday it's not triggered yet but it's uh, it's still good so in the in the area in the members area for potential long fifth wave trades for today on the 29th of august our members simply click on the image and download the spreadsheet the spreadsheet looks something like this for today as you can see this is the 60 minute these are the potential longs on the 60 minute coming out of our scanner today also at the bottom of the spreadsheet you can see daily and weekly so let's concentrate on one of these examples and set it up on the chart so I've gone for WPX we discussed this in the trade room yesterday actually is uh, getting close to setting up did pull a little bit further but came back into the daily so the gray um, Spawn resistance zone you see there. I've taken from the daily time frame. This is the 60 minute chart. So now you can see where we are with our current wave four is a really strong support and resistance zone in this recent uh, choppy area here. So we are looking to go long here. For our members that have the indicator suite, all we've done is isolate at these lows. Uh, on the 60 minute time frame and our indicator suite has done the rest for us we've got a wave one a wave two a wave three and a wave four but we're really interested in this wave four pullback so this is our think or swim version of our elliott wave indicator suite uh, it's also available for multi charts trade station and ninja trader nt8 but this is the tos version think or swim and i just want to go through the initial filters that make up our stock scanner single signals for our members then also uh, set this up for a trade so first of all we're interested in a pullback against the main trend the main short-term trend at the moment is bullish we've got the wave three and now we've had the wave four and that's what we're really interested in at the moment as you can see it's pulled back into our green zone this is one of our probability zones we've got green amber and red the green zone represents an 85% probability it's going to go on and make a new wave 5 high into our automated target zones up here in blue. Also, it's found support in our uh, support zone that we uh, support resistance zone that we've put on from our daily time frame, part of our multiple time frame strategy. Then these the 535 oscillator, the top of the two subcharts here join the wave four has pulled back between 90 and 140 percent really good behavior on this wave four so far as long as it doesn't break the 140 and starts to crown and come back up again this is a good wave four also on the stochastic we've got a special false breakout stochastic on the bottom here we've got the yellow dots and line on the top here in the overbought zone denoting a very strong bullish trend and then when the stochastic pulls back against that strong bullish trend and crosses over in the oversold zone the likelihood is it wants to go back and rejoin that main bullish trend so those three basic filters make up our signals each day that our members can download on 60 minute daily and weekly time frame so let's set this this up now we have WPX on the 60 minute found support yesterday. It could go lower. It could go into our amber zone. But at this moment in time, uh, this is where, where, where we are before the market opens. And we are looking for a sensible entry. So we want to be outside of our 6.4 moving average high, the green moving average on the chart here, part of our Elliott Wave indicator suite, which gives us a conservative entry. So for the first uh, 60 minute candle position today 1883 would be the entry to go long the stop loss would be underneath the wave four so 1849 is the stop loss and that gives, gives us a risk to reward of around about 1 to 1.8 into the middle of our target zone there so great risk reward great setup very simple we wait for that wave four to find support if it comes lower we cancel the order we wait for the support to be found and then we use a six four moving average high as our entry position so you know this this becomes live during the session if we do get slightly new lows but at this moment in time we have a good support level there 
we've got a stop loss at 1849, an entry at 1883, and a target around about 1945, 1950 there. So great risk reward, very simple setup from our stock scanner membership. Also using our Elliott Wave indicator suite makes it even easier. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.